Hey, what's up, guys? It's me, Eddie, and... I returned. Ooh, tree. Oh shit, Kel's hurt. Wait, how do I fix this? Alright, so small, uh, small problem. I don't remember what I'm supposed to be doing. Yes, pretty boy, I haven't beaten you yet, Rose Lad. I completely forget what I was supposed to be doing. It's just a glorified rock, paper, scissors game. face just changes back to neutral. Mm -hmm. 
Slap myself in the face how many times? Checking the uh, tutorial again. My younger brother told me there's no shame in doing this, so. You know, I assume there's no shame in. Uh... But I realized we haven't been to Zeno's before. And you know, there's a lot of stuff to check out, so, you know. chubbier and tubbier, but I can't help myself when we live so close to delicious food like Gino's Pizza. Oh, mmm, pizza. Mmm, pizza. Hello, hello, my name is Gino. Ah. Uh, I know what you're thinking, and no, I don't love this place. They gave me a free whole pizza for my birthday. Let me turn up the volume. Every year, so that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. to being a musical connoisseur of sorts. Do you have a pet rock too? I just got a pet rocks not too long ago. Am I still in the beginning stages, but I'm sure it'll be powerful someday. Do you want to clash? Hell yeah. Come on, buddy, let's work together. Oh my god, it's a... <laughs> Oh. Eight eight so 
pizza hole. Oh, pizza. get started I thought we were trying to look take clues for that thing really quickly what whatever happened to all the emergency want well, to hear the good news or the bad news both and I'll just start with the good news so the good news is let me turn down the volume holy shit Goldilocks zone boom I'll just start with the good news so the good news is we got three different pizza orders today the bad news is our delivery boy called in sick yet again. These customers are all our regulars, so we start recording their addresses a long time ago. I can't remember what they look off, off the top of my head, but I remember what they look like. Here, just take these notes and you'll be fine. Pizza man gave you his pizza notes. I'll go grab your uniform. Don't be shy, wear your uniform loud and proud. Now remember, you have three pizzas to deliver. When you're done, just bike your way back to the shop. I'm counting on you. <laughs> Please find the house with the... Jail? In the yard? I'm gonna have to check the walkthrough for this. Oh. Find the house with the... <laughs> what is this game? Seriously? Find the house with the... Goyle. What the fuck is a Goyle? I mentioned something about a yard. They all have yards. What the hell? The walkthrough different? <laughs> Hold on. House in the yard. House with the Is that a G? G O I L L. Goyle. In the yard. And, I presume that's and, the line. the times in the yard. It's got a Goyle in the yard. It's got the times in the sand. Is a goyle. What, what? House with the goyle in the yard. Avoid the times in the yard. With 
the goil in the yard. Does he refer to the pole? Find a house with the light brown roof and the light brown roof. It's in this one? The light brown roof and the what? <laughs> The light brown roof and the... The light brown roof. Brown roof. Process of elimination, it could only be this one, right? What? Wait. No, wait, that one's on here. The light brown roof and the... Something... Is that a car? Dar? Dock. What? The light brown roof. Not this one, not this one. That's green. It's a green roof. There's more? Oh man. Oh man. It's got a light brown roof. Is that brown? Leap of faith. with the gray stone chimney and the red roof. The gray stone chimney and the red roof. The gray stone chimney and the red roof. Oh, finally!
Com it's honest work. I just got an achievement. Complete all the part-time job ones. Hey, Sunny, how'd you do on your job? All right, all right, all right. Let's battle again. I don't accept that I lost last time. Yes. Yes! baby. Yes! Darn, your pet rock is pretty strong. I guess me and Buddy... Let me check the walkthrough because apparently a lot of this stuff is like largely intuitive. All right, it, it, it talks about doing the uh, what should we call it, the, the samples and stuff. Blah blah blah. All right, yeah, the fly swatter. Tutorial says, uh, bakery being closed on Sundays is one of the f only things that signify what day of the week this is. Sunday, which means our move is this Wednesday. Kind of move to, uh, kind of weird to move in the middle of the week. That is true. Wh why the hell would you do that? Get this back.
before I walk through, godly walk through. Tell me what I'm supposed to do now, because... I'm- I'm gonna be frank with you here. Is what I was about to say, but apparently, uh... Food healing doesn't work in real life. Which makes sense. Oh. I was literally just wondering about that. How do I heal myself? And uh, apparently that's how you do it. One eternity later. just going through all like the side jobs so I figure why not I do that as well oh, I see you're here to tutor my son Brent hmm more than one of you but you guys look pretty trustworthy I guess it's possible two tutors will be BS at one as long as you split the payment haha <laughs> please come in Brent is waiting for you in his room upstairs a shoe rack a coat rack Potted bamboo stalks, at least that's what you think they are. Ooh, a fireplace! This gets used every now and then. There's an open book on the table. At this point, we shall briefly comment on the. Oh. I'm not reading that. What kind. Why the hell are you reading elemental? Make yourselves at home. Brent is waiting for you in his room upstairs. Lifetime Scientific Achievement Awards. Oh, oops, didn't mean to do that. A nice lamp. Hey, it's uh, shaped just like our house. Oh, wrong room. An alarm clock for responsible people. Set five minutes early. A basic lamp. A grandfather clock. I assume this is the bathroom. Dang, so much nicer than mine. Mathematical sciences. A bathtub. Some towels and toiletries. A mirror. A toilet. Yeah, holy shit. Why why do you have a <laughs> Why are there books in the bathroom? Jeez. Okay. Is that a tomato plant? Nice to meet you, my name is Brent. Yeah. <laughs> Kel. Alright, so this is a worksheet that I'm struggling with. This equation is giving me trouble. Pick Randomly? Oh my god. Bro, that's easy. Oh, I got it! I understand now! 
How about this one? Oh my god, wait, hold on, hold on, let me... 15. Wait, 15. 3. 30. 29. Wait, what? Wait, 29, oh, plus. Oh, I got it, boom. Look at me, I'm a genius. What does X equal? Holy shit, okay. Well, actually, this isn't that hard. 10x, 22. Oh, damn it! Ugh, I did it! <laughs> hey, you're just testing me, right? That way it challenges my critical thinking, too. Wow, tutors are really smart. I am. What can I say? They call me a bit- uh, they, they, I'm, I'm, I'm something of a mathematician myself. I think I got the better hang of this than before. Thank you! Thank you, indeed. Hey, Brett, how are you doing? Oh, I see you completed your worksheet. Well done, tutor. Here's a payment for your help. You got $20 for your hard work. Feel free to come back tomorrow. He doesn't even look at Kelly. He just knows Kelly didn't do anything. Ugh, math. Yeah, I think I got a much better hang of this than before. Thank you. I feel you, man. Ugh, math. But it's easy math. So it's, you know, literally just arithmetic. Steady the art slow cooker. Perfect for busy or lazy moms. That's what you're trying to commercial once. Salt and pepper shakes. A microwave. A house phone. A newspaper. Porcelain vase. Re re really fragile and expensive. Best not to screw with that too much then. And yes, we are coming back tomorrow. Who are you? Let me tell you a story. I was walking back from Fix It after making a purchase with my hard earned money. When I looked down, lo and behold, my brand new garden shears are missing. Yes, it's true. My brand new garden shears. Oh my god. <laughs> Good old tutorial. Let me let me see what you gotta say. Wait a sec. Really? You found garden shears. You give garden shears to red glasses, lady. Ah, oh, thank you, boys. I'll be sure to never make such a silly mistake ever again. It's rare to see young boys willing to help a stranger these days. Feel free to- aww. more 90s than Super Nintendo at Hobbies. Uh-oh. I don't want to get spoiled. <laughs> I think- I think I caught sight of what appears to be something critical. Nice lamp. A bunch of books and magazines. Unfinished cup of coffee. Blah blah blah. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh, a toaster! Let's see what you have in your fridge. Avocados, eggs, blueberries, and grapefruit. A table lamp. Japanese, I assume? This is a... It's a... It's a... It's a yoga studio. Snip, 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 snip. Ah, hi there, you two. Didn't expect you so soon. Look here. Can't for these bonsai. It's a hobby of mine. It helps me relieve stress. Kim and Van... Yep. They better not be late again, or else... Mother of the enemy! 
How could this be? How could such a kind woman have such terrible children? Pruning should be done regularly to maintain the shape of the bonsai. All bonsai grow at different rates, so it is necessarily to value each tree's growth rate and adjust the trimming to accommodate. Blah blah blah. A basic lamp. How could this be? I don't like Kim and Vance. They're assholes. Towels and toiletries. Ooh. All right, same text. Yeah. Well, not really. Yeah. Makes it obvious. Wow, Aubrey looks super chill here. Look at that. She looks like a you know a, a normal human being and not like whatever. You know, whatever fucked up demonic shit we saw last time. Well, I'm, I'm exaggerating, of course, but look at her! Although, damn, you really don't look like- You really don't look like the Aubrey I used to know. That's sad. I mean, Aubrey looks super nice here, but she's- It's still nothing like the Aubrey we used to know. Or Aubrey, uh, from the other world, which... What's this house? A bunch of rocks. Is this the, uh... Hey, hello there, what can I do for you? A blue flyer, I knew it! Ah, you must be Joy's new language tutors! Oh, shit. An interview is too much trouble. You should know second grade language, right? No. My daughter Joy is waiting for you in her room. Shit, I don't know, guys. Oh, professional. A shoe rack. A bunch of magazines in a language you can't read. Fuck. Joy should be in her room right now, thank you for your help. <laughs> what have I got myself into? A newspaper? A TV remote? These are prone to getting lost. Unfinished cup of coffee. Okay, blah blah blah. Nothing we don't know. Never change, Cal. Never change. Hold on. Has it already been 40? Holy shit. Okay. This is a worksheet that I'm stuck on. This question is giving me a little trouble. Oh, this is easy. Oh, okay. I see now. How about this one? Silently read your book. Wait, hold on. Silently. Adjective describes noun. Adverb. Okay, I see now. Yes, one hundred percent, baby. Grammar whiz. Complete the grammar worksheet correctly. Damn it! I could have gotten a. Oh man, only if I had made such a rookie mistake. Hello, hello, Joy, how are you doing? Are these tutors of any help to you at all? Ah, I see you've already completed your worksheet. Amazing work, you should consider tutoring full time. Here's your payment money! Please come back tomorrow. He doesn't even look at Kel, he's just. language. That is extra hard me because my big brother Michael stopped going- Plays guitar at the faraway plaza sometimes. He's really good. Oh, that's 
your... Oh, who's this? Photo of a stranger. You open the pot. Hmm. Smells like dumplings. Ooh, tasty. Some bottles of sauce and vinegar. Rice, string beans, and a lot of dumplings. Yum. I'm getting kind of hungry, not gonna lie. A big bowl. Ooh, apple. Alright, guys. I, uh... After that long ass detour, I. Yeah, after uh, that long detour, essentially what I was supposed to do was, uh. Look for the scooter. There is so much more to do here. Honestly, I don't even know if I'm gonna do half the shit on camera. Also, I had the right idea here. I'm supposed to go to this guy, apparently. Mm, looks like Aubrey isn't here. Mm -hmm, looks like Aubrey isn't here. Oh, wait, I know. Oh, wait. oh, wait, I know you. Your name's Charlie, right? I see you hanging around Aubrey sometimes. You know where she is? Now, Charlie, I tell you you're really not the mean type of person. Aubrey took something important from Basil, and we need to get it back. Is there any way you can help us? Finally, we're getting on with the actual story. Who, what, and where now? What'd you do that for? Ah, if it isn't killing that weird knife guy, we're the adversaries for the mighty. <laughs> oh god. For the great and mighty angel. Finally, it is time to meet your doom. Angel, we don't have Angel, we don't have time for this. We just want to find Aubrey. Do you know where she is? You seek Aubrey, do you? Interesting. I will tell you what I know. But first, you must best me in bat battle. But I don't. I don't. Nah, screw it. Fuck them kids. These these kids are demonic. Let him. S let's sick him, Charlie. Hell yeah, let's beat the crap out of them. They're bullies. They deserve it. You surprised me, Kel. You would make a worthy rival for my master. Ow. Jeez. <laughs> you, you'll pay for this. That's it? My training was all for nothing. Ow, my head hurts. You're the one who's you're the one who started it. You bully! <laughs> you're the one who literally started it! Uh, Alright, Angel. Alright, Angel, it's time to be serious now. We beat you and Charlie, so tell me where Aubrey is. Hmm. Promise is a promise, I suppose. I'll honor my word and tell you what you know. Truth is, Aubrey is somewhere in faraway town, probably. Dang it, ain't dang it, Angel! You better not be messing around, or else. I tell, I told you, I tell you what I know. The truth is, I don't know anything. Angel, you better tell us where she is now. Or I'll tell everyone about the time you wait your bed at summer camp. Huh? <laughs> what? You can't do that. That's cheating. Anyway, I, I really don't know. Maybe you could ask my master, the Maverick. He's the keeper of all knowledge. He told me that himself. The Maverick? Mikhail? Oh, I see. So it is him. Where can I find Mik I mean, the Maverick. I'll tell you what I know, but you'll have to fight me first. Or I can tell everyone about the time you- Gah! Okay, fine, I'll talk. Master went to the fountain at Faraway Plaza. He says, oh my god. Oh my god. 
Oh no, not the cute girl! Oh no, we have to save her from the creep. <laughs> oh, disgusting. Come on, Sonny, let's go to Faraway Plaza. I think we're done here. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> we're gonna have to start overriding older files now. No, we can't let that cute girl get taken up by that creep. The funny bit is, isn't that what a creep would exactly say? And then I told him, it's not Maverick. It's THE Maverick. Oh, the Maverick, you're so funny. Oh wow, what amazing story, the Maverick. Girls, girls, please. There's enough of me to go around. Here to admit defeat. <laughs> I okay, actually kind of like this guy. This guy's hilarious. Finally here to admit defeat. Who are you? I don't have time for this, Mikhail. I'm looking for Aubrey. Have you seen her around? Stop calling me that. I cast away that name a long time. He's like a neckbeard. Mikhail, do you? Mikhail, do you know where she is or not? Again with that godforsaken name. How dare you make a fool out of me! I, the Maverick, will not stand for this! Prepare to meet your doom! Watch this, little ladies! I'll wipe the floor! Oh no, we're gonna beat you up in front of these girls, you fuck twat! Please, Mikhail, don't do this to yourself. I'm gonna ask you one more time. Fight me, you want? Don't be a chicken! Ah, <sighs> really gonna do this? Okay then, not sunny. Come on, Sonny, let's take it down. Oh, Kel, you pitiful fool. You don't stand a chance against the Maverick. It's two on one. I should have bought more bat. Hmm, <laughs> not bad. This fight's just getting started. Sonny, why is your damage so fucking pitiful? Kel feels angry. <laughs> As expected of my arrival. But I must tell you, while you're fooling around and playing sports... What do you mean that... I was honing my techniques for just this moment. You'll re never reach my level of skill. You're going down, Kel. I like how he's got a tear. He's just so extra. Ha, is that all you've got? I've only been using 10% of my power. This guy watches too much anime. Behold my final form. I bet you're regretting your decision now. I'm just way too cool for you. You're nothing but a loser. Tire yourselves out. My victory is imminent. This is a battle of attrition that you are not gonna win, my guy. Maverick starts making fun of Kel. Kel feels angry. Kel attacks Maverick. Ugh, 
I'll admit, I'm impressed. But you're still light years away from defeating me. Uh, uh, oh, this is impossible, improbable, absolutely inconceivable. No, I won't let it end like this. No, it can't be over for me. People of Earth. Lend me your strength. This guy watches way too much anime. hey -ya! Ew, what is with this guy? He's so lame. This isn't worth ten dollars. Oh, snap! This isn't worth ten dollars. Let's get... Oh, ladies, please come back. I have more money. <laughs> Yo, fake you, Nikhail. There is no one here by that name. Please, I'll never ask you for anything in my life. Just tell us for Aubrey's and we'll go. Okay, fine. I do happen to know where she is and I'll tell you on one condition. You must call me by my true name. The Maverick. Oh, forget it. I should go find Kim. She probably knows where Aubrey is. Her and Vance are major sugarettes, so I have a punch there. Probably somewhere near Candy. We saved you! Wow, that boy... She's hopeless. I won't tell you where Aubrey is unless you call me the Maverick. You know, fuck this guy the schizo. He's a weeaboo. He watches way too much anime. Knowing Kim and Vance, they're probably somewhere around here. Oh, there they are. Oh, hey, there she is. Nerd! I'm not here to snitch. We just need to find Aubrey. You know where she is. Huh? Aubrey? I don't know anything about that. And even if I did, I wouldn't tell you. Ah, I've had enough of this for today. Kim, let's make a deal. You tell me who it is, and I won't turn you into stealing all that candy. I thought you said you weren't a snitch. And I don't need to be if you tell me where Aubrey is. You two again? I thought I told you to never come back in here. Smiley, smiley. Oh, yay, Psycho Lady's back. Uh-oh. Hand over the stolen candy! Don't make me call the cops on you kids! Smiley, smiley! We've been... We've been busted! Fine! Here's your stupid candy! Come on, Vance, let's get out of this dump! Fuck these two. Ha! Serves you right! Wait. How will we find Aubrey? Wait, how will we find Aubrey now? Uh, come on, Sonny, let's go follow them. Wait. Jesus Christ. Hold up one sec, Sonny. I think I have an idea. Sorry for the holdup. Let's go catch Kim and Vance. Can't we just beat the snot out of them like we did with everyone else? I'm not feeling very sympathetic to any of these people. Let's see, what's this? Nothing.
Yeah, there's a ton of stuff you could do. Follow Kim and Vance. Sorry, Vance, no candy today. No, not again. I don't know how much longer I can last. We're going to die. Uh, let's just go home. We're going to be late for dinner. Wait, Kim. I have something for you. You- Bully! You guys are the bullies! Jeez! You again, Kel. What the hell do you want, you bully? Tell us where Aubrey is and I'll give you this whole bag of candy. Really? The whole bag? I mean, wait. You can't buy us off with candy. Who do you take us for? Idiots? Yeah. I don't know, Kim. We haven't seen that candy for an entire week and there's a whole bag right in front of us. We don't even have to pay for it. Can you at least ask if he has any taffy in there? Stop it, Vance. We have to stay strong. When we go to Dad House, we'll have all the candy we want. Okay. I'll do it for you, sis. Kim. Vance. I'm waiting. Heh. <laughs> like we'd accept candy from a bunch of nerds. Oh, man. Really? I was sure that would work. No! Beat him up! Fight! Wait, please, Kim, you're the only lead we've got. Please take the... Come on, Kel. You're a cool guy, but you can't... Kel, you're too pure. Sometimes you need to get your hands dirty. Let's beat these fools. They're assholes. They deserve it. We, we even have Taffy in here. Did someone say Taffy? I see. That changes everything. Fine. I really want to know that badly. What did I tell you, huh? What? I wanna fight. Come on, put him up, you two. It's time to put him out. Uh, what is it, you guys, I'm fighting? The dog-eat-dog -dog world, Kel. Sometimes you just gotta beat up assholes. Down. What? I didn't- I didn't hear what you said. <clears throat> Wait, well it's a good thing we stopped up on these. Can't as less help. Your face annoys me! Focus fire. Rumble, rumble, you're still nerds. Bro. Yeah, nerds. You're getting beat up by a bunch of nerds. According to your own logic. Who's a nerd now, huh? Ouch, that hurts. Sonny, you're not. Alright, all I ever wanted was some taffy. Hell no, no taffy for you! Uh, 
I can't believe he lost. He never let Aubrey know. Oh, fuck you. We're telling. Come on, kid. We gotta. Go on, kid. We gotta go home. It's almost time for dinner. And mom's gonna be. Your mom's so cool. What the hell is wrong with you two? Must be jeans from your dad. Wonder if she married an asshole. Wait, where do you think you're going? We want, so you need to tell us where Aubrey is. Oh, yeah, that's right. Aubrey's at the church, the one near her house. Oh, huh? Aubrey's at church. Hey, don't look at me. You're the one who wanted to know. Also, she asked you to tell her it wasn't me. Say it was Mikhail or something. Come on, kid. We gotta scoot. You know how mom gets when we're late? Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Let's go. Smell you later. Nay. Oh, nuts, they took the. No! Blessed. Well, at least we beat the fuck out of them. <laughs> at least I think we do. Yeah. God. Alright, the fuck is a church? What? What the fuck is that? Oh! Well, here we are. This really is the last place I'd expect her. Kinda skeptical, actually. It might be a trap. Open the door a little to take a peek. Oh shit, we didn't. Hmm, looks normal to me. I think they're in the middle of a sermon. Oh! Th there she is on the right. Hmm. She's just sitting there. All normal. So weird. Yeah, I'd feel pretty bad about interrupting this. We should probably wait until the sermon is over or something. Hold on, Sonny. Let's wait until the sermon is over. The statue of a religious figure he feels that it is judging you. Walk in like that, Sonny. Well, there's no turning back now. Come on, we have to be really quiet. Shh. Are we just gonna walk up to her? I thought we would just be here and, uh... There she is on the right. Walk to the pew behind her. That's where we are. Oh no, don't interrupt now! Psst. Aubrey, Psst. What? What the? What the heck are you guys doing here? I wanna give you, give back Basil's photo album! on about that? It's none of your business. Really? None of my business. We all used to be best friends, but now this is none of my business? Yeah, Kel, exactly. We used to be friends. Oh, fuck you. You know, Mario would be really sad to hear that. Heh. Really? You really want to bring Mario into this? Who cares what Mario thinks? Mario's d Hey! Hey, what? I was seriously, what's wrong with you? You have new friends now, but you can't forget old friends like that. My old friends. My old 
friends weren't there for me when I needed them. So that's what this is all about. Oh, please, and now you're throwing a bitchy temper tantrum over all that. I'm right, passed on. We, we're all dealing with our own stuff. You're kids. It was hard. I think it's all so simple. You've always been so... Oh, hey, shut the fuck up! Kill's awesome! So what if I am? I'd rather be simple than be like... You- Oh! How could you do that to Basil? You know how important this photo album is to him. It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you could just steal it. Is that what Basil told you? I'm the one keeping it- What are you talking about? That photo album belongs to Basil, and I'm not leaving until you agree to give it back. Ugh, you're so persistent. Mario died, you moved on so fast. You know I come here every week. I'm trying to find some peace. Doesn't look like that's happening today. You haven't talked in four years, Kel. A lot changes in four years. You think Sunny? You think you and Sunny think you could just barge back into my life and tell me what to do? Well, you think you could barge into barge into others' people's lives and steal their shit? So yeah, don't be so naive. You might look different and act different, Aubrey, but you're still the same person. Hmm. Aubrey, you know, is long gone. That's kind of depressing, oh Jesus. Aubrey, that was your friend, she's long gone too. Okay, fine, I get that you're angry. Look, if this is a pod you want, here, I'm sorry, okay? Should have been there for you when we lost Mari. Man, that's, Kel, that is, <laughs> Kel. All right, Kel, I love you, man, but that is like one of the worst of, that is like a conditional apology never. Look. I, I, I don't like this Mar I, or I don't like this Aubrey here, but I, I'm gonna be honest here. In this one very specific instance, I'm on her side. That is a terrible apology. No, I don't accept this. Wait, w where are you going? I can't let you go unless you promise you give me back Basil's photo album, you thief. Basil? Isn't that the boy who? See Aubrey now she's stealing as well. Oops. Nah, she deserves it. You think you're the good guy, don't you? think you're the good guy, don't you, Kel? And I'm the big bad bully here to terrorize poor defenseless Basil. Yeah? You're the one hanging out the psychopath who carries around a knife. Now's not the time to do this, Aubrey. You don't get to say that. You're the one who barged in here. I already said I'm sorry for everything. You want me to be a bully? Then I'll be a bully. You two better come at me quick or I'll come to you first. Oh shit. I'm wondering if, uh, not attack, hell attacks Aubrey, Aubrey just spits on his shoe. <laughs> Obi-Wan, sorry, just, I got Obi-Wan. I can't believe you should bring, I can't believe you bring a weapon here, so how uncivilized. Well, pop it off now. You attacked us. I was wondering if, uh, not, if attacking first would be. Why are, why are, why are you here? <laughs> Well, we're delinquents too. Well, fuck it, might as well win. Oh, damn! <laughs> Why? Why now? Damn, this is... 
girl in French this night. Damn, alright. I mean, that's a little, that's a little harsh. <laughs> I don't know if you were, uh, exaggerating there, but that's, uh, that's, okay, that's a little harsh. I always thought she'd be in trouble. The pastor should have kicked her out a long time ago. Ugh. Get it. It's not worth my time. I've. Oh. Well, that explains a lot now, doesn't it? Oh god, I feel terrible saying that. Ah, ever since her father left, she's so uncontrollable, disrespectful. I feel bad for her mother. Hmm. Shoot, I know she's kind of been messed up lately, but I still feel sorry for her. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> Damn. <laughs> what are you? <laughs> yeah, I, I feel you. Our family comes to church twice a week, sometimes twice, sometimes thrice. Oh, wow. Hmm. I actually want to condone fighting in the... But that seemed. I mean, wow, you're understanding. The girl always come here, never talks to anyone. I've tried to approach her a few times, but she comes to me. Er, bad things. She seems very troubled. Perhaps she could use a friend. I don't know, guys. I'm. I've always considered myself on the empathetic side, but I. I really don't vibe with people that are. No one's really listening to this story, but I don't know. I've had a similar uh, story myself where I used to have a friend that turned into an. Oh wow, you uh, live in this dump. Hmm. I mean. Aubrey just dumped something into his trash can. Let's, I assume it's a photo album. Well, I don't believe it. It's Basil's photo. Aubrey, what if what if we didn't catch you dumping that in there? Well, I don't believe it. It's Basil's photo album. I can't believe she would throw it out like that. Yeah. It only took us half a day to talk about teamwork and me randomly working on things. How about, on the bright side, at least we have Basil's photo album now, and it only took us half a day to talk about teamwork. How about a high five, Sonny? Yeah! Yeah! Up high, high five kill, that's an achievement. Let's get this Basil before it gets dark. He'll be so happy when he sees it. Knock knock! Basil, it's your friend, Count Sunny! Oh, hello there! Who are you? Hi, Basil. Oh, wait, you're not Basil. I'm sorry, my name is Polly! I'm Basil's caretaker. What? Oh. Oh, hey, Kel. What is it? Hey, hi, Basil! We got your photo album back! Huh? You did? Wow, thank you. He basled back his photo album. Bess, 
Cecil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? I always seem to cook just a little too much. D dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Come on, Sonny, pre-dinner. <laughs> oh god, my throat. <laughs> Doing the kill voice is not good for my neck. <gasps> this is Vassal's house! Please make yourself at home. I'll go ahead and finish up the food. Wow, it's been a while since I've been in here. <clears throat> Ugh, you definitely have a lot more plants than you used to. Ah, uh, yeah, I, I like them a lot. Actually, that's some... There's some that are still alive from when you guys came over here. I came here more often. Wow, wow, you sure are dedicated. Yep, that's Basil for you. Flower, flowers and photos. Oh, that reminds me. Now that we got your photo album back, we can all go through the photos together. Ah. Uh, that's, uh, I don't know. It's been a while since you looked through them, hasn't it? Come on, it'll be fun. Um, sure, okay. Aww. The old photo album. Here it is. My first photo. It's my best friend Sonny trying out his new violin. He's starting to take lessons again so that he can play at recitals with his sister Mari. So exciting! Just Kel being Kel. So many party acts. <laughs> he looks like a snail. Uh, Sonny playing a video. Sonny playing a video game on the couch. Sonny's a little shy, but he's a really good listener. I always end up venting to him when I get upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. Back from the park, but Kel is still full of energy. Challenge Hero to an arm wrestling match, but we all know who's gonna win. Please go easy on him, Hero. Yeah, Hero, how much older is Hero? <laughs> Oof, <laughs> sorry, Kel. <laughs> Better luck next time. <laughs> Kel is still feeling a little about sorry. Kel was still feeling a little sorry about losing to Hero in an arm wrestling last night, so Hero decided to lead him for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, brotherly love. Me showing Sun did Mar did Aubrey tear out some of the photos? Me showing Sunny a book I've been reading. Amari stole my camera and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I really should keep better track of my things. Oh, uh, there's younger Aubrey. What happened? Jeez. It's all this cuddling with sunny stuffed animals. He has so many and they're all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. Mari is teaching everyone to make flower crowns. Here's Sonny and Kel holding Mari's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mari thought so too. Hero's still making his flower crown. He's taking it. Okay, I'm not. <laughs> oh, I'll, I'll read this one. It's raining super hard today. The rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture with her new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. She has pink hair now. Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella, but Kel seems to be taking it just fine. He says he likes how the rain tastes. Just Kel being Kel again. Went to Hobbies with the shop holder Ted. Told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting all his conics away. Sorry, shopkeep. Pretty busy with school lately, but we finally made time to get together and go to the park today. Here's Kel hanging his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. I should have fearless as First day of summer vacation, so we all wanted to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Kel cooling off with some refreshing orange joe. I shouldn't get too close to Kel's known to spill his drinks. <laughs> we buried Sunny in the sand. It took forever, but he looks like he's enjoying himself. I wonder if he needs help getting out. I guess we'll keep him company till then. Yay, Sunny's turning 12 today. Even though me, Sunny, Aubrey, and Kel are in the same year, Sunny is younger than all of us. <clears throat> He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. Sunny holding a super huge present for Mari and Hiro. Hmm, I wonder what that is. You can't really tell from the... Ooh! Sunny seems more interested in the box, though. He acts like Mari's too kitten. Meow. Sunny won't leave the box, so can't pull a food bowl inside. <laughs> I guess this box will be Sunny. Wait a sec, is that, that, tr that place inside the tree stump, that's the, 
Going beetle catching today. Here's Kel ready to pounce on his next victim. Oh, and Sunny's there too. Looks kind of sleepy. Yep. First day of school today. Me, Sunny, Kel, and Aubrey are up bright and early. Aubrey's so photogenic. <sighs> Goodbye, Summer. Until next year. are still missing. Maybe Aubrey kept them to herself. You'll we'll have to get those back later. On the bright side, look how short I was. Haha. <laughs> I know I've grown at least a foot since here left for college. I can't wait until he gets back. This year I'll finally be the taller brother. <laughs> anyway, don't sweat about the missing photos, Basil. Me and Sunny will take care of things for you. you just focus on getting back to your happy, carefree self. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Sorry about the wait. Dinner is taking longer than I thought. Would any of you boys like to help? Yeah, sure, I'll help. I got some experience helping my brother cook and stuff. Oh, that would be lovely. Please follow me. The kitchen is this way. I should probably get going now. Oh, how long have I been recording? Okay. I'm, this is nice. This is interesting. I really like the new development. I really like this new development. Boom! So, yeah. I guess I will leave it off at that. Oh, man. Oh, I guess that's the end of that. Uh, thank you all so much for coming by. Uh, I, my voice hurts. It's time for dinner for myself as well. I'm probably leaving it off here. So yeah, I, uh, I guess that is that. I hope you all enjoyed this video to anyone that's watching. Yes, we'll be going getting off here. The sky's up and you guys are awesome. I will see you all in the next video. Well, see you next video, folks.